right, so we're back in their life and death household with Luna and Minerva. And I have Luna ready to go into work in two hours. I've been on the fence on whether I wanted Minerva to join a career or just focus on um, finding the tarot cards. So we'll see. I might just focus on her doing her kind of soul's journey and finding these tarot cards. That's kind of, I think, what we want to do. But let me know if you want me to put her in the, um, the funeral director's career. We can do that. I mean, she's got a little bit of time. We can try it out. But it is a rabbit hole career. So, I mean, it'd be more like seeing what we can unlock. What do you get when you, you know, through the unlocks in that career? All right, let's put this in the fridge. That's good. Like I said, we've got work in two hours. She wants to finish university. I don't know if I'm going to do that. I think I'm still going to try to rewrite some of her her soul's journey to try to get something that, you know, we can do. We'll have time. I'm not probably going to make this a long legacy or anything like that. So going to university might take too much time. But uh, I'm going to see if I can get her some goals we can do in the time we're here. Because I definitely want to play this for a few weeks. And we're going to play it, kind of alternating it at least what once a week or something i think i put in the uh in the community tab what our schedule is so yeah so it's it's about once a week we'll be stopping in so i know i'm probably playing a little slower than a lot of the other let's plays but that's fine that's fine you know it's about it's about the discovery and the fun so let's see can we do draw our daily reading real quick Oh, is there blood on this? You know, I never noticed that there's like, it looks like there's like a, a red, a bit of red on here. Hmm. Okay, so we got the Wheel of Fortune reversed. Resistance has taken hold and you might feel the rotation turning against you. It's time to hunker down, seek comfort and make peace with change or else you'll never know what may strike. A hug or staying on law is desired. Okay. Well, maybe I can see if I can get her to get a hug before she goes to work. Um, that is interesting for Wheel of Fortune. I do kind of view this card when I do tarot reading as like fate and destiny. And it's true sometimes it's, um, you know, when it's upright, it feels like everything's going in your favor. And in reverse, you just kind of got to go along with what's happening. So, uh, so far, the readings on these cards have been very, very good. Um, I'm very excited for that. People who are maybe getting introduced to tarot for the first time through this game are actually learning like what these cards mean. So this is really, really good. Um, let's see. Let's socialize. Let's teach mimicry. Let's see. How are you doing? Can you get up? Oops. Yeah, you can. Let's go ahead and wake you up. Let's give your mom a hug friendly affection hug I might have her also give a hug back just to make sure see what happens hug. Back. we're gonna join oh well, that was fast okay <laughs> I did it just in time I guess hopefully I don't know if it'll count for Minerva but Let's try this career. I'm so excited. Welcome to the Grim Branch. Here you'll learn the ropes of reaping and attend Grim's very own training session. Make your way to the Scry Bowl to receive your assignment and then feel free to prep for the reap by com completing tasks such as research assignment, practice reaping, and perform scythe maintenance before traveling. As an employee, you'll want to hit your weekly souls quota, which you and your nether line contribute to with each reap. Feel free to check your status on the computer. Okay. Ugh. I did want to read one thing real quick about the world here. Continuing the cycle of completion and simulating new beginnings. The world depicts a future fraught with possibilities. Oh, wait, that's... Did we get the Wheel of Fortune reversed? When did we get the world? Did I misread something? <laughs> It's all right. Um, the world depicts a future fraught with possibilities. As one level ends, another begins. Guided by the four elements, four seasons, four corners, and the universe, one may persist in their cosmic journey. 
Anything else? Luna is off to work. Okay. So let's see if they got like a little mailbox here. Donate lost soul to science. <laughs> okay. So let's see. What can we do? Let's introduce ourselves. Everyone's coming to get their uh, assignments. Let's do a couple friendly introductions. Oh, we already know this one. So let's, is this the re is this Grim? Oh, that's Grim. <laughs> let's do. Let's get to know our boss a little bit. There we go. We can practice reaping a little bit after we come in and say hi. Let's do this is Saya. Saya Sakamoto. Oh. Let's see how we look. Oh, we look cool. We look good. Let's get to know our boss. Oh, is that Edith just chilling over here? Or Esther? Wait, why is she dressed like Edith? What's going on? I'm confused because like last I checked, Edith or Esther doesn't look like this. Okay, well, I don't know what the game is doing, but <laughs> maybe someone else can explain that because I don't know. Okay, um, check soul quota, analyze death trends. Let's do that. Uh, let's practice reaping. We'll do this and then we'll we'll scry for an assignment. See what's going on. Why does my neck hurt? Feeling bitter. Oh, is that because of Esther? Uh, there's more to life. That's hard to say, actually. <laughs> I guess it's a play on there's more to life. So there's mortal life. Uh, stats that say death by killer rabbit is not trending as high as it could be. This gives Luna an idea. What if Grimm could start a petting zoo featuring these fluffy little monsters? <laughs> this idea could certainly increase the stats, but how could we promote this endeavor? Surely we would need to warn Sims of the potential danger. Or do we? Well, we're trying to get it trending, right? So let's advertise a fluffy pet. <laughs> We've learned Grim is lactose intolerant. Very nice. Okay. What? Did I <laughs> Sometimes I know it's simlish, but I'll hear things. Like, I swear that guy said, what's up, dude? Okay, so let's do some reaping. All right, so yeah, we had a best friend grudge because probably from Esther. Cheered to death. A grim presence is afoot. Hold on. Even if Luna knows Grimm's here on serious business, it's hard not to roll out the red carpet for an appearance from a guest as honorable as this. Bonehead. Did Luna forget her onboarding? Yikes, hopefully we can sweep that under the rug. What? Oh, from analyzing death trends? Oh, is that because we we chose to um, <clears throat> to have advertised fluffy pets? <laughs> okay. Do we need to perform scythe maintenance? Let's do that. And then we will scry for a job. And then we'll try to do that. So Lake goes. There we go. We probably can get Thanatology books like any other skill, I'm assuming. See if I can get her to practice reaping. Oh, it won't let me do it again. That's weird. That's so weird. Let's see if I can get us talking to Grim. Ask about afterlife. Let's do that. This a rat? Oh, yeah. Subscribe for travel. Let's see. 
We can go ahead and travel. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, no. Wait, I'm supposed to research assignment. I think I do that on the computer, right? Um, career. No. Order office supplies. Uh, how do I research assignment? Select a bookshelf. Oh, okay. We can go to a bookshelf. Okay, gotcha, gotcha. Over here. Research assignment. There we go. Second up to our boss. <laughs> Figure the better relationship we have with Grim, the you know. Like I said, uh, we might see if we can strike up some romance at some point. We do know him now, so I guess we can probably invite him over. Yeah. Um, let me see. Can you go ahead and care for yourself? Just so. Haunted by embarrassment. Luna's fatal case of embarrassment has resurfaced. Aw. Um, maybe I can use the restroom here and try to chill out real quick. Give myself a pep talk, yeah. Perform scythe maintenance. I've already done that, but let's do that again. No? Okay, um... We'll worry about that. Let's go ahead and travel then. Let's go ahead and do that part. I can do. Uh, would you like to travel to your assignment location? Be advised that prepping for the assignment is recommended. Once finished reaping, you will return to the office to complete the rest of the daily task. Okay. Reaper training. You've arrived at Reaper training. Here you'll find Kenny, our undead all around good dude. <laughs> they killed Kenny. Oh my God, they killed Kenny. Uh, Kenny is unfortunately dead at the moment, but don't be alarmed. It doesn't hurt. We think head over to his crumpled little body to survey the scene. You'll want to investigate cause of death to determine cause of death before you start swinging your scythe around. And if you'll, and if you need advice, Grim is here to help. Okay. Determine cause of death. Okay. <laughs> I love that he was standing up and then he falls down. Okay. So, investigate cause of death. Let's check position of body. Let's check pockets. <laughs> Let's check temperature. Luna is making small steps toward the cause of death. Okay. An assignment has surfaced. Huh. Amongst the swirls and ripples guiding you towards oh. Reaper training, Kenny, our undead all-around good dude training sim, is dying to meet you. <laughs> Disclaimer. Grim is not liable for any accidental reapings, false self identification, or negative repercussions. All right. Um, check pulse. Luna is making small steps. Luna's best thing is going poorly, steering her further away from the truth. Ooh. Check for position of limbs. Check for rigor mortis. Great forensics. Luna has investigated the sim and surrounding right. evidence thoroughly determined cause of death is now available. So let's go ahead. For her to confidently prescribe. Killer deductive skills. Now you're ready to collect a soul. Based on your prep work, you may be able to try a specialized reap or feel free to stick to the one tried and true your choice. Collect soul lazily. Now let's just collect the soul. <laughs> well, yeah. Nice slice. Kenny's soul has been placed in your inventory. Before you leave, you're welcome to request reaping review from the remains of the deceased or from lingering bystanders. It helps boost morale. Next, return to the office and release its soul into the netherworld portal. Don't forget to also file a death certificate for the NWDD loves red tape. All right, let's see. Can I get a review?
Uh, no, I don't want... Let's see. Is it under friendly? No, it's... Maybe it doesn't matter. Request a reaping review from the dead. <laughs> Felt good about the level of service despite the circumstances. Okay, so that's that. Return to office. Let's click sell for travel. And I can't get a reaping review from Grimm. Let's ask to look at his slab lid of souls. And then we'll travel back. Nice. Luna has eerie feeling by the end is near. No, your mom is chased by death, not us. Hello, darkness, my old friend. Luna saw her name at the top of Grimm's list. What? What? No, please. I mean, I have also no problem playing as a ghost. <laughs> I was hoping that was going to be Minerva at some point, but if it's Luna, I guess we'll make do. <laughs> Oh, okay. Well, let's travel back so we don't, um, let's do our, our scythe maintenance and then we'll return back to office. Saw herself at the top of the list. How could you do that? Socialize with co-workers. There we go. Who is this? Joyo Mulowin? Wait, how do you say your name? Yeah, Mulowin. Okay, let's do a friendly introduction. Actually, I should start checking if I have like a morbid introduction or something, right? Maybe we'll do respectful and not friendly because we're not really, a, I wouldn't say a friendly oh, sim. We're not really into, oops, sorry, cheerfulness. Order office supplies. Hey, 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 hey. I need the computer. Let's all order office supplies. There we go. Okay. Let's go do what we need to do. Gossip about Grim. Let's not let's not gossip about our boss. Unless we're gonna talk about uh, our probably looming crush on him. Do you think we all actually work for the NWDD? It seems quite strange for them. It seems for them outsourcing. It seems quite strange for them to be outsourcing the living. I don't mean to be a skeptic, but but something is fishy about Grim, and it's not the baleful bog smell. Something's fishy about Grim. What do you mean? Never. Not our Grim. She's crazy. Don't listen to her. Okay, we're gonna order office supplies, and then where's the soul thing? There it is. This is beautiful. Release soul to the netherworld. It says all souls, but <laughs> I'm scared to click that. Like it might be something. <laughs> could you imagine if you could accidentally like mass kill every sim? Talk about starting a new save file. Okay, that was nice. All right, so. File for the death certificate. Let's do that. Uh, file death certificate. And then we got to get to the slablet and recalibrate. No, let's just play. <laughs> we will play with some of that, but I don't want to get in trouble on my first day. All right. So we did gold. So we're doing great. We're actually doing quite great. I haven't even seen what's upstairs. What's upstairs? Oh, more computers. A oh, food! Which we are hungry, actually. I don't know how much time we got, though. So we might. Oh, and there's another bathroom. Whoever built this uh, did a really good job. This looks great. Anything special about Grimm's computer? No. Okay. Yeah, this. Um, this build is, is very well done. I really, really like it. 
She'll end in an hour. Our workday will end in an hour. Wrap up what she's doing. Uh, yeah, we're kind of doing this last thing. We've done scythe maintenance like twice, so we're fine. Um, and we can go home. Let's go ahead and do it again. See if we can get... Yeah, we're gonna... We gotta attend one more workday and we'll be able to get our... Um, promotion right now we're a reaper all right um that's all we had to do go ahead 31 minutes let's go ahead why would it end in a penalty if i've done at literally everything on the list i don't get that i mean we don't have time to do anything we'll just like walk out here Is there anything else? <clears throat> um, da, da, da. I don't have anything else I can do. Oops, we're gonna run to the restroom. I don't even know if we'll make it. <laughs> I don't know if we even have enough time to make it to the restroom. But. It was a very fun day at work. The career is very fun. And like anything else, I can see how it probably can get repetitive, but I'm eager to go on my next work day and actually like reap a real person. We need food, right? Yeah, we're pretty good at everything. We just need some food. We might take a bath. Um, how is she doing? Does she still need like a hug and stuff? I don't know if it did anything for her. She's happy. Um... Let's, we're gonna run around with you after we just take care of her needs real fast. Can we even look up soul clutters on this? No, oh, actually, yeah. Here, go ahead. Yeah, go ahead and get your food. What about your mom? What is your soul thing? You wanna take a day trip to the creek. So let's, let's do that real quick. Um, let you take care of yourself. Let's travel. We're just gonna go. We're gonna leave our daughter at home now that she's home from work. Let's just go to the park. I, the, you know, this is just vanilla Willow Creek. I haven't done anything over here. <laughs> we'll maybe play a game of chess in the park real quick. See if that counts toward our, our bucket list. Uh, meet the locals, have a good time, all that good stuff. Not every destination has to be particularly exciting or out there, you know? So let's, um, let's join this game. Introduce ourselves. Hello? You're my, her daughter is a reaper. <clears throat> no, thank you. I don't want to do that. Let's say hello. I don't think this is, counts as a local, but we'll do a um, friendly introduction. I forget. Is she a cheerful so, so. sim? Is that what it is? So. No, we're not. We're not cheerful, but I guess we have high charisma. Yeah, so we have high charisma. Sure. Nice. You can't eat a meal. Spend a day. How long is a day? So I guess I'm gonna hang out over here until it tells me I've spent a day. We are hungry, so let's go ahead and grill. Is there anything that's like not super expensive? Like literally just some hot dogs. <laughs> After life anonymous is starting now. How long do I have to stay in Willow Creek? We're not getting along. Let's do a cheerful introduction to this lady. So I haven't met any Willow Creek locals. But Oh. Uh, uh. Huh. Uh. It looks like it might be going up. Huh. Splurb. 
Zarb Dwim, Abin. And we gotta go get steamy woohoo in a steam room. I have to put down a spa in a uh, new crest or something for her to do that. Alright, so let's go ahead. We won that game. <laughs> we won that game. Let's go ahead and eat. I don't know how long the day is, so we're just gonna try to chill and see how long that takes. <laughs> Alright, so go ahead and do that. We have a serving. Do another cheerful introduction. There you go. I don't know if that means I have to spend like eight hours, but we'll try. Mm. We're already tired, so we also might have to lay down on the bench and take a nap. See if I can get it to count. I'm gonna be really sad if I can't get it to count. All right, so let's finish. Let's get, stop fishing and let's um, let's go to the bar. Oh, you can like fishing. Yeah, that's awesome. Um, yeah, let's travel to the bar. Yeah, it's all right. We didn't need to catch any fish. I'm just trying to get her to spend time doing something. Um, yeah, let's go to the nightclub. We're having. Grandma's out here just having a great time. Is there any... Is this Bob? Nope. He's from the Order of Lenore, though, and I do want to talk to him. Let's do a cheerful introduction, because I want to meet him. He's part of that order, isn't he? And I'm still collecting um, tarot cards. Let's go. We are getting tired. This is not working for my thing, so maybe I do have to start like in the morning. Boo. Maybe if we talk to this guy, it's not a total waste. All right, so let's introduce ourselves. Tell an engaging story. Oh, we can offer him a tarot reading? Let's do that. Let's make some money. That's kind of what I wanted to do, so I can just offer him to strangers. I want to collect tarot cards from him. What more can I do? Activities? Oh, offer help with a favor. There it is. Let's offer help with a favor. Oh, yibs. Love does not cease when death takes hold, but sometimes meaning does. Ghosts get lost and it can help. Be up to the living to reignite their inner flame. If you see a ghost, show some kindness. Let me know what you find. I'm dying to know what makes them stay. Looking into the hood of a reaper can really make you reevaluate what matters most. Maybe you understand, maybe you don't, but you look like the type who can lead the way. Earn, earn your keep in this community by helping me sustain some family joy, and I might be willing to part with my treasure. By helping me sustain some family joy. What does that mean? Uh, the ghost one, I can, uh, I understand what they want. So let's see what that. Meet a ghost, ask ghost about unfinished. Oh, okay. So it does tell me. Okay. Awesome. All right. Well, there's plenty of ghosts at home. So let me just see. Is there any locals? Dominic Fires is Windenburg. So no. I don't see any locals. Am I crazy? 
Oh wait, no, he's always the springs. So, I don't know. That was a bus, but let's go back home and I can talk to a ghost at least. All right. Um, that was great. So we can offer terror readings. That's cool. Did it say anything about that? No, not really. Okay, so here's some ghosts. Let's go. Hello. Let's do a cheerful introduction to Felix. What's this other ghost? Koji. Hello, Felix. Yay, boo, Cruz. Oh, I have to go to Afterlife Anonymous. Oh man, we just missed that. So, yeah, group meets every Monday and Wednesday and Friday at six p.m. So, well, we can do it tomorrow. Okay. Oh. We have our Alice of Sorrow, so we need to do this too. So we gotta go into um gotta go into the crypt. So let's go home. Well, we tried. We did meet one of the um people from the society, the Tarot Society. So that's good. At least it wasn't a total waste of time. All right, let's get in this crypt. Let's go. See if we can find Deimos. Enter if you dare. Grab a drink. Why are you grabbing a drink? I keep saying to grab a drink. Alice of Sorrow. Luna comes across an ancient and forgotten sarcophagus. A name can be read on the stone tablet next to it. Deimos. This must be it. This is one of Alice's children. The words in the tablet read Deimos, son of Alice, skeptical, genius, and macabre. Lived a full life and passed away as an elder from death by cow plant. His very last word as he accepted his fate of getting swallowed whole was sentenced. Okay, find the next offspring. All right, I have three hours before work. Okay, so what can we do? What do we need? We don't need too much. What is there a perfect mood we should go into work? Ideal mood is focused. So let's see. I don't have too much else going. Can I watch channel Politicim? Will that maybe that'll make me focused? How you doing, Mama? I'm gonna do that. We still gotta ask ghosts about unfinished business. So we can get our tarot card, but um, also, can we buy? We can look up historical deaths. I want to see. Can I buy? Can I purchase a book on thanatology skills? I can. All right, let's buy a thanatology book so we can start reading that. Uh, both of us. Best ring, but you better not have bitterness with your mom. Why would you have bitterness? Unless it's somebody walking by. Why would you have bitterness with your mom? Please don't. Why, why do you have a festering grudge? Why would you have that? I'm gonna have to have you guys repair your relationship. I don't know how to even do that. Hmm. Vent, maybe? It does has a, it has a vent. Maybe I can do that. Let's try it. I don't know if that's gonna work, but. 
Let's see if we vent, if it'll help her feel better. Also, can you feed him? We got work in a few minutes, so we'll have to repair this relationship when we get back. Oh. Feeling great. I don't think it made us focus. I'll have to figure out what makes us focused. <clears throat> I know you should be able to watch something on TV that does, but I just don't know which one. There's an afterlife emergency. The netherworld portal has malfunctioned, causing things from the other side to spill over. Room really needs your help to get things back in order. Hazard pay not included. <laughs> okay. Um, repair the scribal. No? Yeah? Repair. Okay. Oh, and we gotta do probably all this. Expel the mischievous ghost. Who's the mischievous ghost? Inclu oh, there it is. Expel the ghost. Dashimo. Hello from the other side. Um, so far when I'm taking this in my other games, I haven't seen any repercussions for it, but I don't want a meta game. <laughs> uh, meta game, I don't know if that's something people say, but I know like um, in tabletop board games and stuff, when you know something about the game, but your character kind of doesn't know and you make decisions based on what you know, not, not what they know. It's called like meta gaming. Um, so I don't want to kind of do that in this case, because I think I think she would be like, um, I'm sorry, but you sound sketch. Uh, so I think she's going to say no thanks. So we're repairing this thing. I guess by repairing it means we're on the slablet <laughs> looking up how to repair it. And not actually tinkering with it, but that's fine. Sometimes like we turn and we look so scary. I don't know if she'll do it again, but she was like looking creepy. <laughs> this lip preset sometimes I'm like it doesn't right it doesn't sit like perfectly right on her teeth, but <laughs> it only makes sense that our smile would actually still be kind of scary. Um, okay, uh, let's expel the ghost. That's what we're gonna do now. It's up here, I think, in this thing. We'll mop that up while we're here, too. Mm. What milestones? Somebody got a milestone? Oh, why don't you just care for yourself? There we go. That's good. And then we gotta close the fissures. There's one here. I wonder what, I want to try to reach into it real quick before I uh, close it. Just to see what happens. Actually, hold on. Let me save. <laughs> Let me save first because we were at the top of Grimm's little slablet list when we looked at it. I don't want to die. For <laughs> real? All right. Somebody handed the horrifying steamy fisher got Luna a prize. We got a moonstone. Uh -huh. Actually, that's something else I would like them to do. I probably want to get them a crystal um uh crystal like desk. Uh lapidary desk. Yeah, close it up. Then we'll reach into the other ones. Mix 
Wait, hold on. What does this do? It says, when slotted into, oh, into the crystal crown. It doubles the chance of finding crystals in the world and recharges the bladder need. Power level high. When crafted into jewelry. Ward moodlets disappear faster. Vampire sims decay. Thirst decay. Spellcaster sims is more successful. Oh, this would be good for her mom. All right. Yeah, maybe this is something for her mom. Okay. And let's go ahead and get down here and do this one. Reach into the netherworld fix Fisher. I keep thinking she's us until I see her face. <laughs> yeah, whenever we have a day off, which... Action will be for, uh, you know, a good part of the week. Unless we, when we get our, um, promotion. Oh, hold on. I got distracted. When we get a promotion, maybe it might change our days. What else did we get? Dr. F. Oh, well, we can sell him. We don't drag here to sell. What do you mean I can't sell? So I can. What do you mean I can't sell? All right, so let's close this one. There's uh, another one around here somewhere. Is it outside? Maybe. Yeah, I just love the idea of this kit with all the other occults and, and the spell casters and the crystal creations. Like, these are just, this is my vibe. Like, I really want to make a legacy challenge where there's like 10 generations of different kind of like elemental witches. And obviously we would have like a death witch who is in the reaper career. <laughs> like you have to have a spellcaster lineage passed down. Which I've learned if both parents are not spellcasters, you're not guaranteed to have a spellcaster chi child. So um, in my alphabet legacy, that's happening. So I think it might be fun. But I'll have to work on that. We'll definitely get there at some point. All right. What was this? Something grabbed me! <laughs> Something slimy! <laughs> Singed hands. Uh, she got burned. But we still got stuff every time. Hey, that wasn't so bad. Luna scored some sweet swag. Ouch. From a pinched finger. A crack of cool. That crack in the ground looks dangerous. Luna should touch it! I mean, we did. We got a sunflower frog. We're gonna sell him too. I don't... I don't need a, a frog. We got a death frog. We're good. Oops. Sorry. Didn't mean to do that. All right. So, but I'm going to keep this because I think I would like to make something for our mother. Some kind of jewelry for her with this. Okay. Um, recalibrate Grimm's slablet. Is there one up here? No, there's not. So we'll have to go back downstairs. Oh, and repair the netherworld portal. So let's calibrate Grimm's slablet. And then we'll repair the portal. Right, like I said, I would love for us to talk to Grimm and work up that because obviously, I mean, the whole point of this is to have a baby with Grimm. I didn't do it in the Reaper rewards, but I should put us a nice little um, Grimmophone in our house so we can call upon him whenever we wish. <clears throat> Honestly, when I did the Reaper Rewards, I was just trying to get through them as fast as possible so that they would stop, like, taking up so much space mm -hmm. in the corner and overlaying all my other stuff. Mm -hmm. But now, now I would really love to have a child because they also get the cool birthmark and everything. Okay. All right, so that's done. Let's go ahead and repair this bad boy. We need this to be working. There we go. Let's repair the portal.
in a prep. Uh, oh, look at the spider! Look at it! Ah! Uh. Well, okay. Creepy crawlies, man. It's coming back online. What's on that slab? All set. Grim Slablet is now in tip top shape and ready for action. Alright, our handiness skill is going up. That's great. Yeah, we have our Thanatology book. I need to spend some time reading. That's what I'm saying. Like, sometimes she looks so angry when she's on the slab. Watch. Let me see if I can catch her again. There we go. Look at this. Look at this face. Like, she is intense. She is mad. Look at her. Dude. I do not want to mess with her. It's working! Nice. That was cool. Okay, um... Perform scythe maintenance. Let's go ahead and do that. That's quick and easy. And then let's um. Have we introduce ourselves to Mana? That's grim. Have we introduced ourselves to this one? Yeah, we have. What about this one? So respectful introduction. So this person gossiping about Grim. No, would never plan reaping schedules. Is this e uh, Esther that we're talking to? No, Salika. Pomeray. Meeting a new ghost sim always makes macabre sims <laughs> like Luna want to squeal with delight. Nice. Boss is here. Let's also like do some friendly inquire about local hauntings. Practice reaping. Yeah, we're good. We can talk to him a little bit. Can Kubu Koiba? Ah, Yibs! From Swiss Garza, Tom. Luna's day will end in one hour. That's fine. We're doing great. Hopefully, that means we will get our promotion. More to. <laughs> and I can't okay we failed but that's all right all right let's um see if I can grab a quick snack um have a quick meal yeah let's just have uh ham and cheese sandwich I think I've got enough time. Grab something to eat real quick. There's a bathroom up here too she can use. It seems like she didn't actually use it. Oh, we could analyze death trends, but we're gonna get something to eat, so we'll be fine. We're a gold already. We're looking good for a promotion, so I'm excited about that. 
Um, but yeah, we did our end of shifts. She's like, um, we definitely got, we got promoted to rest, rest receptionist. <laughs> Luna has been promoted to receptionist. Nice. Uh, she will now make an additional six dollars per hour for a grand total of 31 per hour. She also has received the following bonus of 254 simoleons. Her next shift is Wednesday at 9 a.m. So we still work tomorrow, basically. Um, that's awesome. Yeah. All right. Let's go ahead and bucket list. Let's write a goal. Uh, actually, I'm gonna help you. Bucket list. Write a goal from a category. I want success. Okay. Let's try that. Not university. We want success though. Let's see what we get. Let's see what we got. Oh, She's off to a great start. Wait. I guess it was a promotion? I'm assuming it was promotion because we immediately got it. Like we... I don't even know what it was. Oh, can we check the silk quota? We can't, right? No. We have to do it from work. I can't just like, no. Okay. Um, let's try again. <laughs> Write a goal from category. I want to create. Let's try that one. Someone's thinking about a funeral. Fire. <laughs> uh -huh. Unknown color. Hang up. Yeah. All right. Let's get. I want to get one. We apparently. I think. I think a promotion. Like. I want to handcraft the perfect punchline. Wait. What? We want to. We want to write. Reach comedy level 10. And I say I want to craft something. Like to me that sounds like I want to paint. I want to write. I want to, you know, knit. I, whatever, like obviously you have to have it installed. And, and I guess because they want to have this work for base game. They're trying to make something that is in base game. But obviously I would think that means like art. You could like lump the dude. I don't know. Like there's a bunch of base game stuff that you can craft, right? That is not reach level 10 of comedy. Like if your sim is not, mm, I hate that I have, I'm going to have to have her clear this out again. Scrap the bucket list. No, we're not doing that again. I want to craft something, but I don't, we're not, a, we're not a comedy girl. Like that's not us. We're not a comedy girl. I'm not doing that. Okay. Let's write another goal. I want to... Let me... Uh, I'm scared to just have her write a goal. I want to um, write a goal I want to create. I want to create something. She can be a creative sim, but I don't want to go to level 10 of the comedy. That's just... I don't know. It's so weird to me. It doesn't seem... I can see that working for other sims, but that definitely doesn't work for my sim. And it's probably just why it's irritating me. But level 10 seems crazy, like level four or something. Like we don't have to get all the way to level 10. That's aspirational, that's, that's an aspirational goal. She wants to do media. You know what, that's fine, we can do media. Level five, that is still the top of the media production, which is kind of crazy. Some of these bucket lists, like, I wish some of these felt like they reference the this pack itself, right? Um, you know, with ghosts and rebirth and all this stuff. And I feel like when every time I try to get my like macabre sim to get uh, a bucket list item, it doesn't seem like it fits her that much. Like, but I guess in some bit she might want to be famous, so we can do that. I guess I don't love it, but. Uh, 
Man, where am I even gonna put that? Where do where do I even put it? I guess I'm gonna have to put it here. I'll have to put it here. That wasn't too bad. It's actually not too expensive. We will have to buy the camera, buy the ring light. Okay. Okay, so she's gonna do some videos. Um, just look at this. Look how much I don't like the way <laughs> I don't like the way this looks. Can I move it like over here or something and out of the way? It's not ruining the vibe. <sighs> move that down there a little bit. Okay, so she should be able to get in here, and then I'll put that table back. All right, guys, yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and wrap this episode up here. We've had a great two days in the Reaper Crew, which I really, really, really wanted to explore. We found Deimos for Alice, so that's going great. We're on a mission from the Le Society of Lenore to find the Lover's Tarot card for Minerva, I think. Oh. They also have a festering grudge, which I have to work on. But we're going to do that in the next episode. So we will hopefully make some progress. And also we have an aspiration to do media, which I'm not crazy about, but we're going to do it anyway. <laughs> so let me know how you guys have been feeling about the bucket list stuff. And is it taking you kind of out of this pack? Because I didn't think it was going to take me so much out of the pack, but it is. And it's kind of killing my vibe. So, I, I don't know. I'll get used to it. <laughs> I'll get used to it, but uh, I hope you guys are having a great day. And yeah, we're going to be back next week with more of Luna Minerva, more of life and death. So, I'll see you then. Bye.